People will ask me sometimes, why did you name your business Redefine Horizons? Why didn't you call it Blink Boy Land Surveying? Uh, people are confused because I don't have land surveying in the in the name of the company. But there was a deliberate reason for that. Uh, and the, the, the basic reason is there's a lot of things that we can do here at Redefine Horizons that can help you as a real estate investor or a land developer long before you're going to need a survey. And I didn't put surveying in the name of the business because I didn't want people to think we that 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 we were limited to land surveying. There's a lot of other things we do related to real estate that can help a client way before they need a survey. And part of the reason I did that was was so often in my in my practice as a land surveyor, I would find people would come to me with a problem, you know, they they would come to me asking for a survey and it was already way too late. Um, it's not that I couldn't help them and that that a survey couldn't help them, but I could have saved them so much pain and suffering and money if I'd have gotten involved earlier in the process. And as an example of that, I had a, a potential client call me a couple of weeks ago from the Bay Area and he had bought a parcel uh, in the Bay Area and he was trying to subdivide it and he was asking me all sorts of questions, you know, can I subdivide? How many lots can I create? You know, what do I do about the topography? Um, is the city going to make me put in a street? What am I going to have to do about sewer? Am I going to need a lift station? These is I mean, just all kinds of questions. And he'd already bought the parcel. And he had a hard deadline to get some financing. And I was, you know, I, I, I was kicking myself. I wanted to kick him. <laughs> like, if he'd have just come to me before he had bought, we could have answered all those questions and he could have made a way smarter investment decision. So, and we're going to try and help that particular gentleman and, and we're going to try and help him if we can uh, you know get the get the financing he needs and and develop his parcel but it's it's hard to do that after the fact it's it's tough because because i get involved way too late and so that's why I, I i didn't put surveying in the name of the business i want people to call us anytime they're thinking about making an investment in real estate or potentially developing land in california and that, you know, the mission of the company is not get stuff surveyed. That's not what we do. What we do is we help people understand, identify, understand, and mitigate risk in real estate so that they can make the best economic use of their property. And surveying is a, is a really important part of that. It's a key part of what we do. And that knowledge that we have as land surveyors and private land planners is really important, but it's not all we do. So I want to do a couple videos where I talk about nine things that we can do to help you as a real estate developer or real estate investor long before you actually are going to need a land survey. And in this video, I'm going to give you the first four. Then I'll do a second video where I give you the other five. So here's the four things. First four things we can do. This is how we can help you as a real estate investor or land developer before you need a survey. So number one, we can check the zoning and we can find out about other government requirements that, that are going to be related to your parcel. Okay. So check the general plan, check the specific plan. We can check the zoning. You know, there's other funky stuff that happens. You know, there might be rules related to uh, flood hazard management or fire hazard management in the part of California that we're in. The irrigation, local irrigation district could have certain rules that you have to follow. So we can help you figure all that stuff out because government uh, rules and regulations play a huge role in what you can do with your property. Second, if you're in Central California or on the coast, if you're in the Bay Area, we can help you evaluate your flood risk. That's really important. It has a huge impact on what you can do in California with your land. I'm going to do another video where I talk about a civil engineer that failed to do that, cost his client a lot of a lot of time and money. So we can uh, we can help you evaluate flood risk and not just flood risk based on what FEMA says, but your actual real life flood risk. What does that actually look like based on our knowledge of the area and our knowledge of flood mapping? The third thing we can do is we can help you uh, prepare preliminary lot configurations. So if you're thinking about a subdivision, we can help you sketch those out. We can look at different options based on the zoning and the and the physical topography of the parcel. We can also do that for easements. We'll help you figure out where you're going to need utility easements or access easements or drainage easements. Uh, that's the third thing. Fourth thing we can do is we can help you develop alternatives, de uh, development alternatives for a particular piece of property. We can help you create uh, quick 3D models and concept sketches of those different alternatives. So you can use that to meet with your business partners and with the neighbors and with your lenders, with your broker, with your lawyer, 
Um, it's something we can do. You know, I have a client, he calls, he says, hey, you know, I want to do X. I said, well, you know, there's been some rule changes. Did you think about, you know, maybe you can do multifamily, maybe you can do mixed use with a little bit of retail. Um, so we can help you kind of evaluate your different options. The law is changing a lot right now in California. They are taking some steps to make it easier to build. So you don't, you don't want to um, pursue a development alternative when there, when there may be a more financially viable option to develop your property. We can help you figure that out. So call us way before you need a land survey. We can help. We can help you figure stuff out. Um, you know, call us when you've got a parcel that you're thinking about making an investment in or if you've got a parcel that you're thinking about development, developing. And again, those first four things we can help you do long before you need a survey. We can check the zoning and other government regs. We can evaluate the level of flood risk. We can prepare preliminary lot configurations and easement configurations. And we can help you brainstorm and visualize development alternatives.